I'm here with Max Bronowitzki, and he is from the University of Bremen in Germany. And Max, Hello. first of all, tell us about your experiment. What is your experiment? Hello. So, so our experiment, capillary channel flow, is the so this is the project and experiment name, capillary channel flow, which is being uh, conducted on board of the International Space Station. So this is the cooperation between German Aerospace Center, NASA, our university, University of Bremen, and Portland State University in America. So our project, Capillary Channel Flow, we are basically interested in a fluid behavior in space, in a compensated gravity environment. And we particular, in particular, we focus on a fluid flow in a, in a capillary channel. So, so just to give you an idea how does the fluid behaves, behave different on Earth and in space, I could give you an example. So for example, uh, when we drive a car on Earth, yeah, we, need a, we need a petrol. So petrol is stored in a, in a car's tank. And due to the gravitational force, it stays on the bottom of the tank. It's, it's obvious and simple to imagine. So, so it's pretty easy to, to, to collect the petrol from, from the bottom of the tank and transport it to the engine. But, but in space, we have a bit different situation. There's no gravitational force which keeps everything on the bottom. So if we look at the spacecraft or if we look at the satellite, the, the propellant which is stored in a tank will not stay on the bottom, it will be spread, distributed everywhere inside uh, wow. of the tank. So, so it's, a, it's, 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 it's pretty challenging to, to, to collect the propellant and transport it to the trusta. So, so, so there are some different devices which, are, which do the job and such as veins which are, which are basically capillary channels which we are investigating. What we do is a very fundamental science, very fundamental research. So we are trying to, in, we are trying to understand and describe the phenomena which were not investigated yet. And the propellant management system is one of the examples. And, but the other applications could be very generally propel, uh, fluid management in space. And not only propellant management system, but also life uh, support system and uh, astronauts, astronauts which live and work on board of the, on ISS, they use a lot of liquids. Not only it's not only drinking water, and we are planning to go to the Mars probably with a stopover on the on the Moon. So we will need a lot of liquids, and we need to be able to manage them and transport them. So this is what's our research about. But there are also some Earth application. So, such as uh, lab on a chip devices and a variety of microchannels used in a biomedical industry. So, all microchannels where these capillary effects, which we are investigating, uh, play a big role. And, and yeah, we've got some results, and it would be not possible to perform such a huge study here on Earth. And NASA gave us this wonderful opportunity to perform these long-term experiments in, in space, which is great. Huh? And you asked about the results, so right. I, I, I don't want to go too deep into the details yeah. now. But you but do I have would, results. <laughs> yes, but I would like to mention that the, we, we ha there is a perfect agreement between the theory and our predictions and experimental results, which is great, and that gives that gives us a lot of motivation for further work. What I would like to say that we 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 really appreciate this help of NASA, and we we do enjoy working with NASA together, and we are we are looking forward to be to be to be to do more experiments, and we do some real serious science, but we but we have fun, which which is great, That's mainly terrific. thanks to NASA and MSG team. So terrific, and he's uh, going for his PhD, so uh, he's a candidate. <laughs> so good luck with that too. Maybe this experiment will help that along. Thank you, <laughs> thank you, Max.